up you guys welcome to my channel i'm back with the truth um we're gonna do a part two to the um the uh part one was uh somebody's about to have an emotional outburst so i'm gonna do a part two to it because i feel like you know i could talk a little bit more about it so um i want to start by clarifying the divine masculine and the uh empress um and then i'm gonna clarify the king of cups reverse which is this priest right Okay, so um, the only message that the only message I've got is refuse to listen. So, but somebody refuses to listen. Listen, see, I can't even talk y'all for some reason. It's like somebody might come try to conversate with you, but it's gonna be really hard for them to talk seriously. Cause like my last reading was kind of difficult for me to talk in. See, difficult. Like I can't talk. Like literally, this person you are gonna have to listen to this person and just hear them out without judging. Just literally just listen because they're not gonna be able to really talk like they want to. You know, to to get it out. You know, you just gonna have to understand and you know do what you gotta do. Okay, so we got the bad masculine. So we got the king of coins. The, Ace of Swords and the Four of Cups. So I, I clarified this divine masculine. And I got deception. I got keeping open mind. Your soul may may differ from your usual, but we got someone that's wearing a false mask. So this divine masculine could have been wearing a false mask. Um, and there was like a third person somewhere somehow. Um, yeah. So they were wearing a false mask, but. They're saying, like, keep an open mind. Your soulmate is different from your usual. So, you know, whatever that means for you. So, this divine masculine, I feel like could be somebody's soulmate, but, like, keep an open mind. They need you to keep an open mind because, like, what you used to may not be what you're going to get. You know what I'm saying? If that makes sense. Like, what you used to get is not what you need. You know what I'm saying? I'm finna give you what you need. You just getting what you want or, you know, whatever. So, I clarified the empress and whoever this young woman is, this empress, this loving, caring, compassionate woman over here, um, like a motherly figure. Um, we get heart to heart conversations. So yeah, I forgot that I even pulled this card. So honestly, discuss your feelings with each other. So I feel like somebody want to come discuss how they feel. Um, like I said, listen, cause it's gonna be kind of hard to um for this person to talk and get it out emotionally, cause I feel like it's been so much deception. But they like, I just gotta speak the truth now. Like they could have an emotional outburst. Somebody's about to have an emotional outburst. Okay, then we get for this empress right here, we get healing family issues, your love life benefits as you forgive your parents. So I forgive I feel like this empress is gonna forgive whoever she needs to forgive, because I'm finna say forgive first before I even finish the sentence. So it's like um, you know how you forgive, but you don't forget this the type of energy I'm getting from this empress. But um don't think I don't know type of energy. That's what I'm getting. So hard to hard conversation. Somebody's gonna come to this empress and discuss how they honestly feel. But they, the empress, you need to keep an open mind because, like I said, your soulmate may differ from your usual. Um, and I feel like this empress is healing family issues. Um, or oh, this what's going on. She's she's healing family issues. That's what's going on with her right now. So we got the priest. So I'm I'm getting like if this. In the last video, I feel like this young woman was supposed to be sacrificed, right, by this King of Cups reverse, which is this pre. This, I want to clarify it again, though, know, but somebody's in despair. So yeah, what I said, I want to clarify. Uh, yeah, I feel like this this um young woman is healing family issues with this King of Cups reverse. Which could be your father or your mother. Take what resonates for some of y'all. This could be your father for some of y'all. It could be your mother. Somebody got romantic feelings for somebody. Okay. Um, clarify this priest. We have unrequited love. There's not enough attraction or chemistry to keep this relationship going. So I feel like between this young woman and this priest, whoever this priest is to you, the one, the, it could be your mother, it could be your father. I feel like it's like I don't have no communication. Um, you know, you may feel like it's not enough love to keep this relationship going. You know, it's been too much. Um, um, somebody's refusing to see the big picture, refusing to see. Somebody here is unstable. I'm hearing, I'm hearing, I'm, I'm studying, hearing emotional outbursts. 
So that's why we got healing family issues. Some family issues needs to be healed or, you know, it's being healed or needs to be resolved or something like that. So bottom of the deck, we have love yourself first. Your self-respect makes you look more romantically attractive. So you have to love yourself, right? If you don't love yourself, how do you expect somebody else to love you, right? If you don't love yourself and give yourself some um, me time or whatever y'all want to call it, and what it is, I call it self-love. So if you don't give yourself no self-love, how are you going to fully commit to giving somebody else? So you mean to tell me you're going to love this person more than you love yourself? So that means you don't love yourself and you don't really know your worth, right? So, yeah, so I'm not going to do that. Let's see, what else can we get at? So we got thoughts. So I'm still on this King of Cups reverse. So this King of Cups reverse is in deep thought. Um, you see that hourglass? I'm always getting cars with hourglass on them. So apparently somebody's running out of time. Somebody's thinking about how they even ran out of time. I told you this person feel like that this woman is their meal ticket out. Yeah, I feel like it was their way out. But guess what? It's over with, though. It's over with. It's, I'm, I'm not only getting like a death. I'm seriously getting dealt, but I'm getting like, it's, it's going to be like a new cycle. Like, I'm getting a whole new world. I believe it's an hourglass. It's an hourglass right here, too. Damn. This is a completion of a cycle, but I feel like for this cycle to end, sadly to say, you guys, somebody have to pass away, you know. Cause like I said, somebody apparently sold their soul, and it's like you know, somebody coming to, to get that, you know. You know, I don't mean to. I'm just saying. Y'all know I'm I'm pretty much a blunt speaker. Um, shit. I don't know how else to be, but I don't want to startle nobody or alarm nobody. But for somebody, this is like a new beginning. Whether you know it or not, you you're not gonna see it at first. Cause, I mean, I know it's, yeah, faithful. Because I'm, I'm getting like, you're a faithful person. You're a faithful. You're a very faithful person. Wow. I'm hearing expect wonderful things is what I'm hearing. I'm hearing expect wonderful things. Somebody, you may actually have a dog, a pet, a dog. Anything else, Spirit, can you tell me on this King of Cups reverse? He very stubborn. Very, I don't know what the words are feel. I'm talking about all the, damn. Oh, yeah, I'm going to pick it up. Okay, we got prison. So, prison fell on the floor. On the floor. So, this person, this king of cups of verses going to prison. Yeah, so I guess that's why they feel like they're running out of time. They feel like that um, this this um, young woman, this empress, was their meal ticket out. And now they done ran, completely ran out of time. So, now where they going is they going to jail. Because somebody's about to speak the truth. Whoever this divine masculine is, they're about to speak the truth. All right? It's been some type of deception here. And now they're ready to speak the truth. Somebody can no longer hold it in. They're about to speak their truth. But they really ain't going to be able to talk. Because, like, my words are like I'm tripping over my words still. And, like, I'm trying to talk. I know I'm talking. I'm trying to talk right. But it's like I'm tripping over my words. So, yeah, then we got the bottom of the dick. I said child abuse, child neglect. Some, this, this, um, this, this, this king of cups of is going to jail for child abuse, child neglect. That's what they're going to jail for. Yes. That's what they're going to jail for. And I'm getting they they could be sick. They they sick now or they gonna be sick. It's like, um they were trying to there was a thief, right? He got a thief car, so it's like they this double confirmation because we got jail right here, refusing to see something, going to jail because you refusing to see something that's the truth. You refusing to see it, so you keeping up chaos. I'm hearing conflict because you refusing to take accountability, like you don't wanna be wrong, like you know what I'm saying? But yeah, you going to prison, double confirmation. That's where you're going. You're going to prison. You're going to prison. And you're going to be sick, or you already sick, or you getting whatever. You're going to, we got my lady. Somebody about to pass away. That's just what it is. Somebody about to pass. I'm getting too many cards. Unfortunately, uh, I'm sorry for whoever this message is for. Even if it's for me. 
You know, somebody's about to pass away. Hmm. Like somebody tried to steal your gifts. Somebody tried to steal somebody's gifts here. You know what I'm saying? Spiritual gifts, tangible gifts, things you can touch. Gifts, thieves, th uh, thieves, uh, time, energy. Spare work, black magic. Somebody tried to steal somebody's gift here. And this point blank period. So this person is going to, j to jail. Okay. Um, let's see. Let's, let's see if we can get some something else on this divine masculine. Yep. Yeah, but then we got the look. Look. Look what I'm look. look. Yeah. Somebody's somebody's on uh, seat. Somebody's about to pass. Man, I'm other cards here. Can you tell me about this divine masculine? What can you tell me about this divine masculine? Let's get one card. Woo. Damn, it just flew out. It hit my arm, y'all. Look, so we got despair. So this divine masculine is in despair about what? About the truth coming out or in despair about telling the truth? They in despair about telling the truth. Like I said, somebody's going to need to listen because it's going to be hard for this person to get it out. Then we have the death card on the bottom of the deck. On the bottom of the, see, I can't talk. On the bottom of the deck. Somebody's in despair of the truth getting out or telling the truth or whatever. Somebody's in despair. This divine masculine is in despair. And fear helpless. So I feel like, what is it? You feel like when the truth comes out, you could be going to jail? I don't know. What is this? Oh, shoot. Yeah, because you could be being watched. I feel like this divine masculine could be being watched. Okay, Spirit, so what can you tell me about? Look, the first card came out before I could. Uh, yeah, the divine masculine being watched got something to do with some money. So it's something in regards to some money. Divine masculine is in the spirit about. Okay, so um, before I can get it out, Spirit, what can you tell me about the Empress? Look what fell out, y'all. Joyfulness. So somebody's about to be celebrating joyfulness. Somebody's about to be celebrating. Which is who? The Empress. Okay, so let's get another one on this Empress. Okay, we got a letter. So, I feel like you're about to be receiving something in the letter that's going to have you celebrating, right? I'm getting that you're a spirit said you stay down. You're, you're faithful. And, you know, you about to reap the benefits. Of you about to ain't reap the rewards of your benefits. Yeah, this it. So look, I split the deck. You guys, look what I got. Bad health. Somebody else is about to pass away. I'm wanting before destruction. Yep. Okay, let's see. High honor. Okay, so we get high honor. So somebody's about to pass away and somebody's about to get high honor. That's how I'm looking at it. That's exactly how I'm looking at it. I mean, that's how I'm looking at it. So Spirit, what can you tell me about this King of Cups in reverse? Look, y'all. Thief. We got thief. Damn. What can you tell me about this King of Cups in reverse? What else can you tell me? Okay, we got sudden wealth. Okay, so I don't know this person. You know, this person stole somebody's money, stole a sudden wealth. Or you could be getting a sudden wealth from somebody passing away. Yeah, thief. We got thief on the bottom of the deck. So, thief. So, this person stole your gift. Or stole a sudden wealth from you that was a gift from somebody or something like that. Okay, but that's all about the change is what I'm getting. Okay, Spirit, what can you tell me about this divine masculine? Ooh, there's too many cards. Too many. Mess of concern. Yeah, this divine masculine wants to reach out. We got mess of concern. So is in despair about giving someone a message about something. And maybe maybe they ain't gonna be able to see it. Maybe they, they need to conversate. We got we got heart to heart conversation, right? Honestly, discuss how you feel with each other. Maybe it could be in the form of a letter. I don't know, because maybe they don't know how to say it. Maybe they're gonna write a letter. Or something like that. Damn, I seen previous lady, but I Okay, we got wealthy man. So wealthy man and previous 
at first I seen Privilege Lady, but I, I had put my eye on it and I shuffled it and I lost it. So bottom of the deck, we got unexpected income and we have wealthy man right here. So divine masculine and we got wealthy man. So is the divine masculine or wealthy man? What what is y'all? I don't know. Somebody want to give somebody with something? Uh, uh some unexpected income. Yeah, we got coffin right here, y'all. It's going to be, um, and this cycle is over. This cycle is complete. Something, oh, my God. When somebody, pay, like I said, for somebody to get a new beginning, something has to end, like, right? So, it's like somebody's about to literally pass away. I'm saying, like, furniture revives all up in here. For real, for real. There's too many causes of bad health and sickness, and we got somebody at a grave site right here, and this is like a funeral. So, this, uh, they go to grave site. It look grave site, and we got funeral right there. So it's like definitely something going on. I'm getting like vibes like this. Yeah. Okay. Let me clarify the empress, then I'm gonna let you guys go. Spirit, can you clarify the empress, please? And thank you. Okay, I'm getting like court situation. It's a court situation going on right now about this situation. That's what I'm getting. Okay, Empress. Okay, we got sudden wealth for Empress, you guys. Sudden wealth. So, I feel like somebody's finna get some money, honey. Somebody's finna get some money. Can I get one more spirit? One more. And I'm gonna end this reading. Child. He wanted to come out the child card, so I'm getting like this this young woman is somebody's child. This King of Cups first child. That's what I'm getting. And look, we got jail on the bottom of the deck. Somebody's definitely going to jail. We got jail right here. We got jail right here, and we got jail right here. Unexpected income. False person. Somebody's being false here, right? Somebody's being deceptive. We got it right here, too. Deception. Somebody's wearing a false mask. You yeah. know. So, it landed on Divine Masculine, so, you know, I don't know. And then, look, we got adjudication, so, yeah, there's definitely a court cool situation going on. Somebody's definitely in despair about that. So, we got that twice, the Divine Masculine in despair. Okay, so can I get one more for the Empress? One more for the Empress. Okay, look, look, we just feel we got the previous lady, so... Empress, previous lady. So this Empress is a previous lady, or will be a previous lady, this young woman. That's what I'm getting. Yeah, and then overall, everybody's happy. So we get the community happy. Everybody's happy, right? Well, not everybody, because some are in despair. Some are in despair here, for real. I'm also getting somebody lost their house, or somebody's, I'm here foreclosure or something like that. Somebody lost their house, and they in despair about that. I'm also seeing that. Okay, so you guys, this it. If anybody would like to donate to my channel, you can donate to Money Sign, Cash Me, Alicia, A L Y S I A. Thank you guys for being here. I hope it helped. I hope it resonated. I love you guys. Bye.